Hi there, Chris here. Chub Tuesday. Um, I wanted to show this cutaway again. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and pick it and I'm going to shoot a light down through it so you can see it a little bit better. That's the bidding on the key. Um, and this one is from... Oh, I can't tell what it's from. Let's see. Oh. It says Chubb there, and it said, oh, I can't remember, like six, 1969, maybe? I don't recall. It is in, in other videos when I was working on this before it got cut away. Um, so it was one of the harder Chubbs I had, and I thought, well, if I'm going to make a cutaway on one, uh, I'm going to do this one so I can see why it's so hard to pick. And one of the reasons it's so hard to pick is if you see that second lever is it's a very, very high lift. Um, the first lever also has a notch to, to grab it, and there's a bunch of notches in the, the back levers that grab it as well. And those are low lifts. And it doesn't show much with... You can't see much with the key here on camera, but I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do is unlock it and then lock it back up and shoot some light into it. So maybe we could see. Maybe you could see a little bit better. It's it's fine for a cutaway and picking to see what's going on. Um. But to get the light in there for the camera is, is the real trick. So, let's see. I'll put the tensioner in and try and keep my fingers out of the way. Keep the light there. And, yeah, I think that might work. And I, I fashioned this one after uh, Brummy did a chub cutaway. And this, this little cutout, these notches, let me get this out of the way, were basically what I could figure out what he did. A lot of times when you cut away a lever lock, it does not function, does not pick as it used to. But this, <clears throat> this amount of cutaway here in the, in the, positions of the cutaway make this one pick just the same. <clears throat> so I was glad it turned out that way. And hats off to Brummy for doing this. Also, Black Dolphin was actually, I think, the first one to show a video of a cutaway. So I got my tensioner in. Let's see, is there a way I can do that? Maybe I have another tension. No, both those turners are right in the way. Well, it's out of the way a little bit. There we go, let's try that. I don't know, we won't lose our light. <laughs> I need seven hands. Maybe if I prop this up on the key a little bit. So as you can see, if you start in the front, you're gonna hit that false notch and you have to, to let that go. So we're gonna start in the back. some point we got to get that high one happening which is the second one oh that's the first one I'm kind of shading my own view and your view sorry about that I'm 
stuck in a false notch in the back, I think. It's either that or number two. One, two, it's not two. You got somebody in the back that are. So we'll start over. There we go. <clears throat> and I'll show, let me get this out. Oh, now I can't, <laughs> I, I flipped it too far. I'll use the key here. Although the key's holding up the flashlight. But you can see at that point, right at that point, all the levers that's better. Are in the in the the key bidding position, so that slides across, and now we're all locked up. It's more fun to watch it being picked because the key just Im immediately lifts everything to where it's supposed to be. It's better. I really wanted to show trying to pick it and show what the the back levers were doing. Anyway, that is. Uh, Chubb's Tuesday with one of my favorite locks, this cutaway. It was an awful lot of work. It's it's difficult. This is a almost a quarter inch of steel to be cutting through. Anyway, thank you, Brummy, for doing it. Also, Black Dolphin. And uh, yeah, <laughs> if you get one. Um, and you, you want information, watch my, this, my videos, Brummy's videos, I have a video series of this as I went. Drill a hole, drill a hole, drill a hole, drill a hole, drill a bigger hole, 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 hole. <laughs> and then kind of try and cut out in between those holes and then clean it up. And that's, it's, it's also pretty tough to get through these top rivets. Um, but anyway, it's, it's well worth the, the big effort so if you're into cruisers <laughs> this has got to be got to be my favorite cruiser anyway thanks for watching we will see you next time